Hi friends. Do you have one of those days that you've got a lot to do? You've made a list of what you want to get done. You're crossing things off your list, but you don't feel like you're getting anywhere. You feel like you're just moving in slow, slow motion, or you're standing still. Sometimes you even feel like you're going backwards. Well, I've had a long list of things that I wanted to do today. I'm not half done yet. And you know, it's almost midnight and I have not even filmed my Vlogmas number 16. So you know what, I just put the list on hold, put on my Christmas Vlogmas stuff and um, yeah, let's get into it. Let's do Vlogmas number 16. Welcome back to my home, welcome to my channel, and welcome to Vlogmas number 16. We are going to call this one the one that almost wasn't. It's been a crazy, crazy kind of day. Do you ever have one of those days that you know it's like the last weekend before Christmas, it's the last weekend before your family comes, there's so much you want to do, and and you're still trying to keep up with YouTube and work and everything else during the week and it's like okay it's the last weekend it's crunch time I've got to get stuff done and it just doesn't seem to go that way it's like every time you go to do something something else happens you go to pick something up you, the bottom of the box falls out and all the nutcrackers fall on the floor that you're trying to bring up the stairs it's been crazy but anyway so we're kind of running out of time it's almost midnight and I'm going to try to get this filmed and get this uploaded. And you know what? Right after, I'm going to move and I'm going to get 17 done. So tomorrow I'm not doing crunch time. But anyway, so Friday night, I finally got my tree finished. There it is, my main tree. So I've got the white tree. This is my bedroom with just the black decorations on it. I've got the one in the office where I work all day. That one's like my multicolored tree, so it's the multicolored lights. It's the decorations that the kids have made during the years, decorations that I've made during the years, and just different things that we picked up that were just kind of fun and colorful. This tree in here, I have no idea why I got this started. It was kind of like a joke when I started it. But anyway, everything that's on it is white, gold, and silver. But again, I added some pictures, and I added some red cardinals, so it's got a little bit of red here and there, but not much. Everything's kind of muted. And um, yes, I finally got that done. That was that was fun. I brought up some nutcrackers today, so I got my snowman corner all done. So little by little, I'm getting there. I still have the main foyer to do. I've got my table. I brought up my styrofoam so I could make some steps to kind of have them different levels so you can see more of them. So I'm hoping to work on that tomorrow. I'm not going to get to it today. Anyway, if I don't get it done, you know what? I don't get it done. It's less to take downstairs later. So we have got a Walmart beauty box to do today. And I think I got this maybe three, maybe four years ago. It's right after I started YouTube. And I thought it was, I don't know, maybe I was supposed to renew it or something, but I got the four boxes for the season and then I didn't get any more. And I thought, oh, you know, I'll, I'll go and check it later. Well, anyway, so I guess maybe whatever. But anyway, so I signed up again in November and I figured, December would be my first box, the winter box. So I got that during the week. And then the next day, I'm like watching the mailman put things in my box again out front. And it's like, hmm, I'm getting another kind of blue box. Um, I wonder what that is. And I'm thinking, well, you know, I know sometimes Nina, just Nina, gets a couple of boxes by mistake. So I'm thinking, maybe they sent me another box. And then I'm thinking, maybe the one I opened, the one they just got the day before, maybe it's not even mine, it's somebody else's. So anyway, I had to go out and get it. Yeah, so I got two boxes from them. And yes, I want to do some Christmas cards that I got. Got a present from Miss Janet again. But let's get into our Vlogmas things so that we can move on and I can try to get seven get this uploaded before before the day's over. Alrighty. So the first thing that we have here, I get the walkers, uh, the short shortbread, the cake, 
shortbread cakes whatever these are so so good so we got our cookie here from their advent calendar this one's the heart shape these are really really good with coffee in the morning sometimes I would rather have my Christmas flavored coffees in the middle of the afternoon like two or three and then I'll have my cookie and that's so so good from just Janet just amazing Janet she had sent a nutcracker chocolate advent calendar and this is the chocolate from there this is like a little bite of heaven it just melts in your mouth it is so so good from our glossy box advent calendar we've got from I think it's vintage well you know what it is there it is I knew that was the name vintage and we've got a couple of things from them over the years I think even from Etsy maybe I've gotten some but these little headbands with these little bows and they're just perfect when you're doing some max to get everything off your face or just washing your face at the end of the night and sometimes when you're cold you can wear it as an ear muff I know how multitasking is this but this one so it's got the uh, black and white stripes and I'm looking at it thinking you know I might have to wear this one on Halloween next year with my Beetlejuice costume and do a face mask one day as Beetlejuice I already have to get one of those green green mask a green mud mask that will be perfect alrighty so that's my advent calendar things other than the wine the coffees have kind of they only had a, like four different flavors so I've just kind of been pulling the same ones. so I'll just grab one tomorrow but I won't show it I've got my glass here with the Christmas trees on it this is from snap elf I think I got a little bit of fuzz on it so I have to worry about that later Got this from Snap Elf, a little Etsy shop. So I will have her linked below. She's really got a cute shop, some nice things, fast, fast shipping. And from our Sip and Savor Advent Calendar, we have this rose. And I'm thinking this is my focus, please. I'm thinking this is my first rose in this box. It kind of came in groups. So I got like, it was like all reds, and then I had a couple of whites, and so. Who knows maybe I'll have a couple of rosés in a row but you know what it's all wine it's all good to see if I can see that fuzz later so anyway it's kind of like a pinky kind of orange very light here it's under my thing oh well so anyway just gonna have a quick sip I'm just not even gonna sniff it I'm just gonna go I'm just gonna dive right in and be surprised cheers everyone it's it's dry but not real dry just a little little dry I'm getting the essence it's very fruity I'm getting like strawberries in here maybe a little bit of raspberries the citrus in here but it's not tart so I'm thinking it must be a little bit of orange flavor in here maybe cantaloupe I know weird already going for another sip and then we'll get into the outfit alrighty so for the outfit this headband got a couple of weeks ago Timu this red and green wig Timu these snowman earrings Timu I'm starting to see a pattern how about you these rings Timu this dress however I'm thinking it's eight, nine years old. Got it from Walmart. Still in good condition. Of course, I'm just wearing it here and there for videos, though I did wear it to work a few times. So anyway, it's like a Christmas tree here. It's a sweater dress. So we've got this kind of faux fur, like right here and along the sleeves right here, and then at strategic places and along the bottom hem. So again, it's like a faux fur, but it's smushed, and maybe that's because it's old, but it's got all this kind of iridescent threads in there that give it a little bit of sparkle. We've got this gold and red garland going around like decorations on a tree. We've got these different pom-poms that are supposed to be like Christmas balls, and these should be jingle bells, but they don't have a bell in them. So just some little decorations on the tree, and that is my vlogmas outfit so before we get into walmart box we got some cards so i want to go through the cards real quick so this first one here is from janine holdy and her envelope's got mary on it 
and she is oh my gosh she is a beautiful lady she's probably one of the first people that I subscribed to when I got on YouTube because I think when I first got into it I was getting into like stitch fix and things like that so I was like hashtagging hashtagging stitch fix to just kind of see what other people were getting to know what to ask for and even how to do videos things like that so she's probably one of the first people I subscribed to and I was like she was nice enough to subscribe back to me and she's just been a sweetheart over these years it's so nice getting to see her and her family her girls are growing up they're like the same height as Janine and then her husband Kevin's like whoo he's way up there but anyway Janine uh, she does unboxings she does like Ray Dunn different displays best coffee bar ever and yeah she loves the Stitch Fix and the Transcend and things like that she does and like the Nordstrom halls and things so some really really good clothes she has one of the best stylists she gets a lot of lot of good boxes so anyway she's also a Disney fanatic and they've been to Disney a few times this year so it's really fitting that uh, she was able to get a card made so she's got the group picture there and then on the back so very merry so I'm going to have Janine link below if you are into like decorating with like Ray Dunn coffee bars things like that if you love seeing what people get when they open up like their Stitch Fix and Transcend and like the Nordstrom sale boxes and things like that you are going to love her she is a sweetheart so I will have her link below Miss Jackie Russell so the back of her card here we've got this cute little row round bellied snowman her Christmas card is a beautiful church that's all decked out for the holidays and there's some glistening snow and things like that so it's a really beautiful card it says holy night and in the card in the card she's got all these cute little stickers in here and uh, dear nancy wishing you peace in your heart and joy in your world now and always have a blessed holiday. Merry Christmas, Miss Jackie Russell. She also put in her card um, this, I'm going to call it a proverb from Colossians 1.11. Alrighty, so it says, when we pour all we have into God's hands, he sifts it like sand, uncovering gems and letting our lives reflect the sparkling beauty of his grace. Your gifts are a gift to many, and I'm thanking him for that. We also pray that you will be strengthened with all his glorious power to you, and you will have all the endurance and patience you need. May you be filled with joy. Where God's workmanship and... Maybe weave. Let me put that up here. Okay. So we're God's workmanship, not his minions. We're kind of like specially made locks, and he possessive, possesses the one-of-a-kind key to each of us, Shanna Noel. So just a little beautiful message here. All righty, my last one. My last card right here is from the amazing Miss Janet. She calls herself just Janet, but she's amazing. So on here, we've got this little Christmas tree right here on the front. And on the back of her envelope, she's got that little red truck with the Christmas trees. Merry Christmas. And her card is this beautiful Christmas tree right here with cardinals and decorations so pretty it says Merry Christmas and so dear Nancy you and I are like two peas in a pod I absolutely adore, adore you I love you too Janet you are amazing you are just the most sweet giving and loving person I've ever had the absolute honor to call my friend she is also just the sweetest Janet um, one of, the, of my friend one of my greatest gifts. Dear Nancy, may, may light of the season fill your hearts and may its music fill your soul. Love you, just Janet. So just amazing. She gave me this little gnome 
with a little hemp string on it to put on the tree. And it's got a little heart and a snowflake. And on the back, just Janet, 2023. So awesome, awesome. But she also sent more. You know, just Janet's like that. So she sent this tin. That's what I do. I read books. I drink wine. And I know things. And you know, if I don't know things, I make it up. That's our secret. Alrighty. And this little glass. I put the black in here so you could see it. And that's because work. And sometimes work can be so stressful that you'll hear all about on Monday, am I playing with me? Monday, the stressful, another stressful week at work. I know, crazy. Anyway, so thank you so much, Janet. You are a sweetheart, and I am just so lucky and blessed to know you and your friendship. Your friendship is just amazing, and she supports so many of us, and I think we all love just Janet. Just amazing, Janet. All righty, Walmart. So the first box I got was all wrapped in cellophane. I just kind of opened it up to see, make sure what it was. I think I got the right one here. So it's winter 2023, this version 11. And the beauty box, it's a seasonal box. So it comes out four times a year. I'm not sure the base price. Altogether, mine was $6.98. So that was probably just a little bit of tax included. So everybody's tax might be different. I don't believe that they charge shipping. The next day, I saw him put another one of these boxes in, and this one is the fall 2023, version 20. So let's open the version 20. Now, my Christmas one, my winter one, had a card in it. This one didn't have a card, but maybe because it was an after sight, I don't know. But it's still wrapped in here with a pretty sticky paper. And then everything's in plastic. And first we got these little doohickeys here. So it's pop sugar. Earth the toilet. So some kind of perfume. Focus, please. Let's see what this is. It's a little tiny perfume thing here. So let's. Got to do it a few times. Okay. It just smells really sweet. Like almost like a candy, like a cotton candy, that kind of sweet. But not bad. And we got this vitamin C Derma E. So a moisturizer and a serum. So that's pretty cool. So you get to use the serum and then once focus please. When that absorbs, get to use some moisturizer. Alrighty, so we've got this Repair Bond by Mock Antony. So a leave-in treatment for all hair types. It's a nice little sample there. And we got two more things in plastic right here. And Nexus, so let me open this, this looks like maybe it's shampoo. Maybe shampoo and conditioner. Alrighty, so we've got this shampoo, color, assure, long lasting, vibrancy. And I'm assuming this is the conditioner. It might not focus, but it's conditioner. Alrighty, so we got those. So some nice size samples. We got this, who knows what it is. I think it's upside down. So Curl Bounce Colossal Maybelline. I'm assuming it's mascara. So I'm gonna leave this sealed, but I'm assuming that must be mascara. So I'm excited to try a new sample of that. And Neutrogena looks like a cleansing gel. So a Hydro Boost with Hyaluronic Acid. All right, so that should probably be focused, please. Maybe one or two. It feels like there's a lot of air in here, so 
maybe one, maybe two uses, but for a sample, it's a nice size. Alrighty, running longer than I thought I was going to. I thought it was going to be real quick. Alrighty, here's my winter box. Got this card right here. And these are the goodies in that box. Alrighty, so... And they show you different things that could be in your box. And of course, if you don't see it in there, it's a surprise. It's a mystery. And you can take a quick survey with that code right there. Alrighty. So the first thing I see in here is a Vino. So it's a daily moisturizing body lotion. It's going to come in handy this winter. I got a bright pen. I think this is probably for teeth, so that should be good. Whitens without the sensitivity. One pen. So it says 10 to 12 applications. So excited to try that. We got this pretty blush here. Wet and Wild. It's called Bed of Roses. So I think that will be a nice shade for me. And we've got this little thing here, which is maybe a physician's formula. Butter Glow. Alrighty, so it's a radiance boosting glow. So I don't know if that's like a serum, maybe? I will read up on it later. It might be in that card that they sent, but maybe it's a primer. Maybe it's a moisturizer with a little bit of glow. And then one more thing in this box. So, not bad boxes, some nice useful items. So let's see if we can see what this is. So it's Garnier. It's a micellar cleansing water. Alrighty, so that was everything that was in my winter box. And again, I had version 11. So I got the micellar water, this bed of roses blush, the Aveeno moisturizer, body lotion. We got the Maybelline mascara sample. We've got Nexus shampoo and conditioner. I lost the other one. We've got the Mark Antony. Was that in this box or was that in the other box? I'm not sure. And the whitening pen. So I was excited to try those things. Excited to have my cookie and my chocolate and my wine. So anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for taking uh, hours out of your day to spend with me. I really had hoped it would just be a short one because I've got things to do. You've got things to do. So I'm just going to call it a night. I hope everyone goes out and has a fabulous, fabulous day. Take care, everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life. Have some fun. Love you guys so much. Thank you to everyone. Thanks, Janine and, and just Janet and Jackie Russell. You guys, you guys are amazing. So thank you guys so much. And we will see you in our next video. Bye.